hi guys welcome back to my channel so today's video i'm going to be trying out the new urban decay moon dust collection they sent it over they just kind of they didn't send the whole collection they just sent over some of it so i can try it out came in this little bag right here it's like a little nice very holographic bag which is very very cute and they gave me like this little paper with all the collection details if you guys want to know about it i did my makeup off camera of course because i just wanted to focus on the products that they sent over and i wanted to try them out for you guys let's just go ahead and get started before we start i just want to ask how are you guys doing are you guys handling everything okay are you guys not going crazy comment down below how you guys feel about this quarantine is it like too much for you is it like okay are you seeing more like the positive side about it you know just wanted to let you guys know that i am dealing with it like everyone else sometimes i'm having good days and sometimes i'm having bad days today i kind of did have a bad day but i turned it around and i made sure to be like you know what you're gonna get to do a video and you're going to do it so that is what i'm doing here and i wanted to sit down and really play with makeup because honestly makeup always makes me feel better if you guys are not subscribed to my channel and you guys are new to my channel and you guys are just seeing my video hi i am yadi i do makeup on my instagram page and i love to post some little review stuff that i get from brands and show you guys what i think about it and i do little tutorials if you guys have not seen any of my videos go ahead and check them out i would love for you guys to be part of my little family so hit that bell notification and the subscribe button to know when i post another video so let's go ahead and get started so they sent over this little paper so as the moon dust has landed this stuff takes glitter into a whole new dimension so this collection is all about glitter and shimmer which i love so it says launch into an out of body sparkle experience. I'm spitting. And then, so they sent out moon dust. I have the moon dust here, lip eclipse. So they come, they have four colors. Um, one's Nova, the other one's solar flare, rising and retrograde. And they look like this. So they're like different colors. I got rising, which is like a nude. This is like a rose gold metallic. Um, so let's just go ahead and swatch it. I do want to just swatch it on my lips. Let's go ahead and try this. So far it opens and it looks like this. I'm going to go ahead and swatch it in my hand so you guys can see. So it's like a very light rose gold color as you guys can see there. Oh, you guys like my nails? So I don't know if you guys know, but like in my other video I had like leopard nails and today I did moon. Moon. Moo, I'm thinking of like the collection. So I did a moo one like cow super super cute let's go ahead and apply it on our lips i really want to see how it looks here it's like literally it looks like my lip color just with shimmer okay next they sent over this so this is like super super cute this is their moon dust eyeshadow and it looks like this it is super super nice I'm gonna swatch it for you guys so you guys can see. Looks like that. And then I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it. See how pretty that is? Oh my god. I'm gonna put this all over my eye. And I'm gonna be pairing it with the new Urban Decay 24 7 Glide On Pencil in Perversion. I don't know if it's new, new. I don't think it is. Um, oh yeah, it's not new. It's an award winning waterproof eye pencil that everyone's raving about. So I'm going to go ahead and obviously try this on my eye. And I'm going to be kind of creating like a little cat eye moment with this shimmer on top. Just kind of blend it very nicely together. So this pencil, I'm just going to show you guys here when I swatch it. Super black. It is so black and it's amazing. So we're going to go ahead and just kind of add this onto the top. We're just going to kind of blend that out. Since it's very like a gel-like pencil... This is going to be really good to blend out. So I kind of did like a little cat eye. And then I'm going to go ahead and grab a pencil brush. And I'm going to go ahead and... No, you know what? I'm just going to grab like this little light pencil. I'm really just kind of smoking it out. And blending it. So you're slowly just kind of blending that out. On the edges here and it doesn't look too harsh because i just want to want it to be kind of like a like a moment you know and then i'm going to add the shimmer on top you guys are going to see what i'm going to do right now that's how it looks right now i got the pencil and then you can kind of go back and kind of making it a little bit more darker and i'm also going to add this 
to the waterline in the bottom and blend that out then this time i am gonna grab like a pencil brush and i'm gonna just kind of smoke it out in the bottom well that is really nice this pencil is so easy to kind of create a smoky eye and you could use this as a base and then and go on top with black eyeshadow just to kind of secure it and it doesn't really move that much but this is really really nice look how smoky that looks that is so freaking cool and then i'm gonna go ahead and grab this one this is in the shade lithium and it's a really nice as you guys can see so i'm gonna go ahead and grab a little bit of that and swatch it and i rather use my finger than a brush so i would recommend you guys trying it out with a finger first instead of brush and just kind of putting it on top. Do you see what it does? It kind of creates this nice, really beautiful shimmer on top of the black. It just looks so beautiful. Do you see that? That is, wow, that's really pretty. Imagine like a really dark smoky eye. That's really nice. I went off camera and I did the other eye. So I'm gonna just go ahead and kind of thicken this corner right here a little bit more and darken it because i really want to just kind of see that cat eye that i did so we're just kind of smoking it out again so i'm just using this brush to just smoke it out again okay but since i kind of like the shimmer the way it looks on top i kind of do want to bring that to the bottom so i grab a flat brush this is the anastasia beverly hills 827 the fluffy brush that i used to kind of blend that out is the a14 from anastasia beverly hills and this little pencil that I used in the beginning, this is a Sigma eyeliner in E05, 05. So that's one that I used. So I'm going to go ahead and kind of add with the A27 from Anastasia Beverly Hills. I'm going to grab a little bit of that into the brush to see how well it works with the brush. And I'm going to be packing this on the outer corner, or I'm sorry, the inner corner. And just kind of creating that and adding a little bit of that there. So I did it with a brush and as you guys can see it looks like this and I'm going to go ahead and try it with my finger so I grabbed a little bit more product and I'm just going to pack it right in the inner corner and blending it outward and you're going to see the difference. Do you see how brighter it looks? So I recommend you guys using your finger more than the brush because it's just you're going to get more pigment out of it. So I'm going to go ahead and add some mascara and lashes and I'll be right back. Okay now that my lashes are on I'm going to go ahead and try this Moon Dust. This is their Moon Dust Glitter Liquid Face and Body Illuminator. Uh, Luminizer, I'm sorry. <laughs> I cannot read today. So it looks like this. This is in the shade Moon Spoon. And it's an iridescent silver glitter. We're going to go ahead and try it out right here on our shoulders. And I'm going to obviously try it out in my face as well. So it looks like this. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and kind of squirt a little bit on. So I'm going to go ahead and just kind of show you guys how it is. I'm going to go ahead and just kind of blend that out and it's gonna look very very shimmering and it's really really nice so we're just gonna see how it looks there it's very very pigmented so what i'm gonna do is that i'm gonna kind of grab a little bit of that and i'm gonna add it to my shoulders so you guys can see we're gonna add a little bit right here so we can get a little bit more sparkle i actually feel like i'm gonna like this this is really really nice i feel like when you're going to an event and you want a little bit more sparkle on you you guys can use this so what I'm going to do is just kind of do, do this and kind of spread this all over. See the difference? Like this is so shimmery and this is just bland. But this looks very, very nice. Super, super beautiful. I'm going to go ahead and do this on the same, on the other side. I'm going to go ahead and do this on the other side now. Just kind of squirt a little bit. Of, you don't need a lot. A little bit goes a long way. And it just looks like this. Look how pretty that looks. Super, super pretty. Now, I kind of want to try this. The only bad thing is it's literally got over your hands. So if you want to use a brush, you guys can. If you feel like that's easier for you, I just use my hands. What I want to try out is I'm going to kind of add a little bit of this to my makeup eyeshadow on top. So we're going to be using a brush this time. And I'm kind of adding this to the top right here and kind of create a little bit more shimmer or you know what I can do I can kind of use this for my brow bone okay that's not bad it's really shimmery so you want to be careful with it but it looks very very nice if you're trying to look for like a glittery look that's really 
cute i love this so much i'm just kind of blending it out so it doesn't look too too harsh okay guys so this is the final look using the urban decay new moon dust collection Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of this look. I actually love each product. Honestly, none of it came out bad. Like, I actually like all of them. I feel like they work very, very good together. And I was able to create, like, a very nice look. You don't have to use exactly what I used. And you don't have to do exactly what I did. But it kind of gives you an idea of how you can work with these products. See how well they work together. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think of this collection. What do you guys think of Urban Decay? What do you guys own from Urban Decay that it's like your go-to? Honestly, my go-to is always that all-nighter setting spray. It is so good. And I love it so much. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And thank you Urban Decay for sending me the products. And if you guys are not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and please subscribe again. And hit that notification to know when I post another video. And if you guys are not following me on Instagram and Twitter, go ahead and follow me there. And wait, TikTok. I can't forget about TikTok. I'm on TikTok now. I'm not the best TikToker, but I'm trying. I'm trying, you know, I'm just a 25-year-old trying to be a TikToker now because we're in quarantine and there's nothing to do. And yeah, so you know what? I'm going to try it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.